Hi everybody, it's Michelle here. Welcome. Welcome to this channel if this is your first time. Um, as well as to those who have, have subscribed, I know. Now for subscribers here, so just uh, a word of thanks for those that have subscribed and um like i said welcome to those that are that are just coming uh onto the channel for the first time we're going to travel back to the world of adonia and uh start planning out the what i call premiere in i usually try and do a big house or an epic build right at the center of my world and then go from there. Um, so I think that's what we're going to do in my world of Arani. Um, I have a huge house um, with four rooms and a lot of storage rooms and craft rooms and you name it, I got it. Uh, so if you guys want every four weeks, I can do what I call a romp, which is well, basically a world tour and I've got three worlds that um I'm working on. One is here in Orani or not Orania Adonia Orani as well as an unnamed world which I'm kinda starting from scratch. I have a flat world and I'm gonna try my hand at building a seed. Uh, it's gonna be totally different than most uh, Minecraft seeds. A lot more resources and stuff that you can find um so i'm going to start now and uh, we'll go to adonia i like i said i haven't done a thing to this world um the only thing that i might do if i am finding that i'm having a lot of trouble is i might add something th through toolbox for miners. That's the only mod I use when I want to do creative story. Or not creative story, creative mind craft. Uh, with a survival twist. Uh, I call it creative survival. So, yeah. So let's go into Adonia. Uh, it's one thing I find with some of the texture packs here is um, at least on my um on this world on this uh tablet i uh i find that sometimes we get um quite the delay let's see what i've got food well, i've got some pigs here so and a cow and we do need both so let's go and do a bit of hunting <coughs> There's a chicken too. I know this is probably too loud, and if it is, you know, feel free to say. Uh, oh, there's an Enderman, but <laughs> that is so funny. I love his hands. Ooh, yuck. Yeah, I'm gonna turn it down just a smidge. Because, wow, that's very, uh, very loud. Now, let's go get my stuff. So, happy Halloween to everybody. Uh, I personally, I don't do Halloween. Um, I just haven't been able to for several years. I'm just checking here. Making sure that we haven't got anything in there. Yeah, I haven't done anything for several years. I just haven't felt the desire to. About the only thing that we will do some years is um, we'll go to um, a mall and take pictures of the trick-or-treaters. I love doing that. I know it sounds maybe corny, but... 
what I find, at least for me, is it keeps the kid at heart alive. And it might give me some ideas for my drawing or whatever. And it, then I'm participating. I'm just getting some of these flowers up because they'll eventually have to come up anyway. And I'm going to do some digging. Oh, there's a uh, key there. Uh oh. Oh, phew. Thought I was going to end up stopping there. I find that if I go and um, fiddle with that silly uh, circle, I find that uh, it just. Uh, kind of gets in the way. Yeah, so there's a cave here, which I didn't know about. So let's go down in here. Uh-huh. So what I'm thinking is we could probably move them in over a little bit and maybe have a... Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Kind of like a... um. Uh, a cave where celebrities can go. So this could be a place, like a casino, not necessarily a casino, but a, like a showroom. So, yeah, like I said, how, how was your Halloween? Um, please feel free to answer questions, post questions in the comments, and I will try my best to answer them in the next. And then that way, maybe we can um, uh, get to know one another. I'd really like that. Unfortunately, I can't stream. Um, I found that my bandwidth just won't take it, so um, it really makes it tough. So you know, and I, I really wanted to. Um, if you go back a few weeks, well, two, three streams, you notice that I, I made a a, a message said saying deleted stream, well, that's what I was talking about. Um, I'm not going to do um, I'm not going to focus on that though, because now is now. Okay, so we're going to have a showroom. And I might um, start putting some signs up too when I um, plan things out. Let's get this out of here and put these three in there. Okay, so we we're thinking of calling it Premier Inn, but of course it looks like it's going to be bigger than an inn. So if that's the case, we will call this a hotel. And, um, that way, we can have things like a, a fancy restaurant and, uh, lots of rooms and stuff like that. So, the reason, well, part of the reason, too, that I'm getting a lot of, of dirt is for planning. Uh, a lot of people go and wing it, but I have found that every time that I've winged it, or whatever, I have not done very well. So, we're going to do some planning and go from there. Okay, let's go and grab Put this away and see if I've got any um, stone to make a shovel. There we 
go. Another chicken to add into there. And yes, I do have one more. So I'm going to try and make this a half an hour recording today. And I hope I can make this exciting for you. Um, if you have any suggestions for the hotel as well, I'd love to hear them. Um, it'll make things a lot better. And then uh, you never know. You could have... Uh, I could make it so that a room, whether it's the showroom or whatever... Um, have your YouTube name. And I will try to make sure that this gets backed up. In fact, my other world is big enough that um, I need to do that. I have lost way, 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 way too many worlds to, um, to not do that. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to do that. Let's a hunt and we will go. A hunt and we will go for two things. I usually don't like doing that, but I need to eventually have. A bed. Oh, already we've got some textures kind of going wonky, which I'm not really keen on, but it's something that, for whatever reason, it happens on my, um, it happens on my tab. So I'm going to, just to be on the safe side, I am going to quit and save. Or save and quit, whatever you want to call it. And it should, for a while, take care of my, um, my textures. Just going to check on, oh. Oh, no. Okay, so... I'm hoping I'm still recording. Um, just got a little bit of an overheating issue here, so I'm going to... Uh, well, I don't know why I'm getting that. So let's go and see if I can call up Minecraft again. Hmm. That's quite interesting. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why it said that. Very interesting. Okay, well, <laughs> such as technical, such are technical issues with regards to technology. So yeah, now things are saved, and we should have no problems. So wait for the that. There we go. Um, I'm gonna go underground because um. It is, as you can tell, nighttime. So put in my food, except for the steak, because we do need. Oh, there we go. I just thought we were out of coal. There we go. Okay, so we'll make some torches. But we do need to get some more anyway. Okay, there we go. So. Wow, this half hour has gone by fast. Okay, so now into our cave. <laughs> so typical of Halloween, you know, monsters and that. So I guess this is kind of a Halloween-y thing that we, um, 
do. It's good. Oh, there we go. I knew that was coming. Oh, not again. My goodness. Ah. Oh, okay. So, we're going to have to continue to talk here, I guess, unless we... Um... Unless we stop, which is tempting. Um, very interesting. It won't let me open it up. Okay. Um, so basically what I'm going to do is... Um, I honestly don't know why this is doing this. Um, hmm. I'll wait a little bit more. Um, okay, so... Yeah, we were talking about zombies and how, you know, this kind of typical, you know, of Halloween anyway. And I hadn't really planned it on this. Um, the, uh, I just, well, decided that I was going to do the Monday thing and see how things went. Um, let's try again. There we go. Okay. Just need a little bit of help there, so let's see where we end up off, because uh, I'd like to um, end off playing, but that's really, part of it could be because I have been doing a lot today of uh, playing on Aurania, but it doesn't make sense. Ooh, that was interesting. Okay, so... Okay, so we're going to redo this. So it took us back a little bit, which is okay. Okay, now we got our iron, which I'm really happy about, because that means that we can, um, when the time comes... We can smelt the iron. Now, I can't remember if the last time that we were down here, if I made a place to go onward further on. Okay, so let's go take a look. Let's get out the sword. Move out. I know. I'm corny. I admit it. Um, it looks like I just did a lot of caving. I should have gone through last the, the video of last time. And I'll try and remember to do that this time. Just to see where I ended off. Oh. Spider coming from somewhere. Wow, do we ever have a lot of um, iron? That's great. We can do so much with iron. You know, I don't know how many of you like um, Harry Potter. But, you know what those, those spiders remind me of? Remind me, remember um, when Harry and Ron and Hermione were learning about Ridiculous with Lupin, the spell, and Ron hates tap dancing spiders. And, or what, sorry, he hates spiders. So he thought that he would make tap dancing spiders. Well, that's what the feet of these spiders remind me of. Wow, I didn't expect that. Let's go down this way first. I did not expect to hit a lava pool. Oh, it's not a lava pool. It's just um, a lava flow. Okay. But yeah, I always remember that 
when I hit, or when I get on uh, Minecraft, tap dancing spiders. <laughs> That's so funny. So, we're getting a lot of coal too, which is great. As you can see, um, I wish I could stream with you guys and talk with you because uh, it would make it a whole lot easier to get to know you and to think of questions too. Um, okay, so what is your favorite thing to build? With Minecraft. Um, for me, it's houses. Although, once I can wrap, once and if I can wrap my head around, um, text or not textures. Um, oh, what is it? redstone. Once I wrap my head around what redstone, um, I might consider working with. Pistons and stuff like that. Okay, so now we're going to go back up to here. Oh, I missed a set. Or not a set, but a piece of iron here. Now, here is where I tend to do stuff. Oh, we haven't gotten here yet. So let's just go continue to go caving. And I think we might have a spawner here. Uh, yeah. I'm not going to go here just yet. Uh, <laughs> I'm not quite prepared. That is one thing that I might do. I know it's really... Um, not really good, but um, I might go into peaceful. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. And um, uh, take care of that. And what I mean by take care of that is make a mob. Um, or maybe I'll do that next week. I'll try and remember, and um, we'll go from there. So yeah, maybe that's what we'll do. Um, what I've done here is I've made steps back up to roughly the same level of the mine, and... Then I'll continue on. And the idea is to go down every so often a level at a time. And eventually you get your resources. You get, um, and I mean lots of them. I used to poo-poo caving and, um, and mining, uh, branch mining. But I decided one day to give it a try. Well, that was the best thing I could have done. I really enjoy it now. And then also, too, once I've gotten to the bottom of the world, so to speak, I... Oh, we've got a series of caves here, so let's take a look at that. Um, I go and I, uh, oh, just work with it. You know, like I go start to go up is what I'm meaning. And so what that eventually does is it'll take me to a new spot and... What I'm planning on doing with that, with any world, 
is I work with um well I'll eventually join two kingdoms up Sounding like it's daytime. So we're close to the surface. But I want to go through these caves first. And as you can tell, like I said, we've got a lot of coal. And those are the best um, you're going to need. As, as you know, lots of calls, so. I know that uh, some of you are probably saying, oh, yeah, 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 we already know that. Tell us something that we don't know. <laughs> well, I am a semi-noob. I will admit that. Ooh, wow. There are a lot of caves here. A lot that lead, lead back to where I was, but there's also one that leads there. So I'm gonna finish this one out. Okay, let's get 10 more here. There. Get this coal. And then maybe as soon as we uh, get going back, we will uh, we'll plan on working the showroom. I'm hoping that it works out. Because really, um, that'd be kind of that's actually something that's kind of neat. I've never thought of a of adding a showroom onto my onto my. Um, I'm sorry, I'm pausing a lot. I've never thought about doing this children month as part of my uh, as part of my hotel before. There we go. Now hopefully I can find my way back. That's the ticket. And this will get us our bed. Even though spawn point is actually quite um, quite close to everything, which is good. And, you know, and that was the thing that when I went and did this, my na the name that I picked. had to have a good seed. I'm just going to do some color jumping here. Uh, it had to be flat. Um, simple reason. Uh, or have a flat spot. I like doing these epic builds. Wow, this is a big tree. Might go a little bit over today. Just so that um, we can do a little bit of um, work on the, uh, the hotel. So once again, if you're here for the first time, 
thank you for coming. Um, maybe someday I'll get to stream. But um, my husband and I both, we really couldn't justify it unless we were both doing some sort of internet work. Um, which, it's basically me that's doing it right now. And um, it's adding an extra 30 bucks onto our bill for streaming For streaming quality, so to speak, and um, I couldn't justify it, so I have to make do with this. Um, where do you? Well, I shouldn't say where do you guys live, but uh, as long as you don't give me specifics, we should be okay. Um, so yeah, <laughs> excuse me. What city? What country do you live in? Um, and if you want city, I live in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada, personally. Oh, there's got to be, there is what I'm looking for. And what we'll do is we'll, um, grab a, um, a stone axe. There we go. Now we're starting to. It's start our trees starting to bust apart, which is good. Now we can make our way down, and as we're making our way down, it'll continue. There we go. Okay. That is coming out. I was really scared there for a minute that we would not be able to um, make it home. But that's one thing going back to what I said last week with regards to the fantasy texture pack. I like the texture pack. Because... The chests and stuff are lined with gold. Now I want to keep an eye on that chest, that uh, that tree because there'll be speaking of treasure, there'll be stuff that'll come down. Okay, so now um, let's put that. Let's get this out of that the furnace, and we've got three mutton. So, let's get the food taken care of first. Oh, I thought I had three mutton there. Hmm. Or some mutton. Let's get this moved up here. Okay, so we've got... Three diorite. I thought I had... One more of those. I guess I carried my my mutton with us. So be that. There's the ravel, which I really don't. You'll find once I start build, really building, I don't have use for gravel and roads. I honestly, I can't stand it. Because for me, gravel is too breakable. So then you end up doing your road really again. Whereas you may or may not have to do that much with stone. Okay, so I'm going to create a stone axe. 
And I'm going to put a little create. I'm not going to create any wood yet because I want to get a another piece of wool. Let's do a quick go over here. We may have to go underneath, but let's see. Maybe we can survive the night. Now, this is on easy mode. Um, there have been times when I've thought about going and not doing it on easy mode. But every time I do that, guess what? Something happens that, uh, well, I'm like, oh, I'm glad I didn't do that. <laughs> All right, let's put the coal in here. And what do you guys think? Do you think the outside of the end should be stone or xyrite with cobblestone decorations or... I'd actually, I'd like to do it in brick, but I'm not doing this in creative survival, so, um, hmm, I also need a stone knife, or sword, wow, okay. oh, no, I put it in there. For some silly reason. Alright. Now we got our sword. Alright. Got him. <laughs> okay. Going to leave it at that. Um, although that doesn't really leave too much for planning, um, because I still need to work or to think about how how I'm going to work on this cave here. Because we need to have it. Might put some dirt here. We need to have it semi big. So there's going to be a lot of filling in in the next couple of weeks. Um, let's see here. Okay, we've got some of these done. So let's make an iron pickaxe. We've only got one piece of leather, so there's no way that we can start on other iron or other pieces of armor. And um, if you were around last week, you'll know that I have a little thing. Use what we've got first. So if you have a, well, like a stone pickaxe, like we do right now. Use that first. Now that's close to being done. So that's why I have decided, well, we will finish that first. Now, I can't remember. Let's go up here. Oh, come on. There's that. I missed last time, so I'm glad I'm bringing home some more iron. Oh, that's right. Yes, we did go through that because we found the, um, the extra exit. If I remember correctly. Oh, I missed a some 
Um, stand back here. Good. That didn't fall. As I was thinking it would. Let's just take a close look around. Okay, yeah, that is the... The entrance. So, it's interesting how... Normally, I put... Stuff on my right. And so, I guess what I put that... And so, there we go. There's the breaking of that. Now, what I do... Is... I also put in via either commands or the creative survival to get the the diamonds pickaxe. That way we can get what we need for to mine the obsidian and stuff like that and and stuff like that because it's going to as all of you know it's, takes forever to to get them. I don't I try not to do too much with regards to um, adding stuff like that because I don't think it's fair. I'm trying to make this as vanilla as possible. The only reason I am doing this, doing it this way, is because of my vision and my dexterity. Now I have to, I do have a, um, a controller and I just have to learn how to play here using it better. So, when we do go back, um, I will, that'll be it for the day. Now, how do I choose to go down? Well, I take a look at things like, well, first of all, not like that. How far did I go? Can I see where things, where my entrance is? Well, yes, I can. So I'm going to go a little farther, maybe only one or th two times. That doesn't mean I won't be going back to explore that cave. So, um, okay, question, how many of you, I know this is a lot of questions, um, so some of you might answer the one, two, or even all three, how many of you would like, would rather me show next week whether I do creative survival, or do you want me to show you you know, with creative mode, with to getting with that with regards to the uh, uh, commands. That way, we could do we could still see what's going on with the zombies. And while I made my make my little mob grinder, so it's up to you guys. You know, eventually I'll decide once I get there. Like, but uh, I'd like to have you guys' this opinion. Okay, so now I'm sure it's you guys that you guys can see further than I can. I can barely see where we came in. So I'm gonna go down one, and then I'm gonna travel along that way. So, you know what? Okay, let's go back.
and um, we'll go from there. Yep, it's daytime, so that's good. And of course I went the wrong way again, I think. Yep. I don't know about me sometimes. Oh, there we go. We're not too far off. Let's see. That's either... That is a zombie. Okay. I won't worry about... Oh, no! Well, I guess we do some cleanup and then I'm going to say goodbye. Now, here's something with that. Uh, it's a good thing that I've got lots in, in uh, lots of room in my inventory. Um, behind this, like where we had the chest, is a hill. But because I'm doing some terraforming anyway, I only fill up to where I've got the, uh, the level that the the grasses makes it quicker all right so let's see what we got here uh, okay crafting table survived which is awesome but it looks like our just didn't so let's put the iron into here use up the last that now let's make two chests oh that's a cauldron and we won't do that until it's time uh where are you well, first of all that's why we couldn't find it there ah no i'm coughing let's do that all right, so chest, and eventually there'll be a spot for chests and stuff like that. We'll have a safe, um, wish I knew more about spawning villagers and stuff like that because um I would love to have this um in with a couple vi villagers like have somebody acting like the guard um maybe a bouncer maybe a waiter I'll put that in there I love getting really creative with this kind of stuff. So not much is seen today, but I'm hoping that will start next week. Um, we did some mining and caving, which was cool. And uh, we got a lot of stuff. Almost got blown up. <laughs> I know. Uh, so, question four. Maybe I'll copy these down and I'll continue to ask these. What would you like to see after the inn? Adonia, because once I get the uh, front door found, like whichever way it po it points, I usually like to start doing roads. I am really, I, how can I say it? I tend to 
go all over the place. You know, if I've got um, a lot built, um, I will go you know, and try and figure something else out. Oops, I didn't want that. Uh, I'll start something. You know, it may only be the planning of one thing. You know, like a planning block. But then uh, we'll go further. Okay, so it is now 7.29. This has been an hour's worth of stream. I am going to leave it there because, frankly, um, I only have 70 minutes left on here. I have to delete some stuff. But I hope you have enjoyed this stream, and I hope that you will join me next week. So, until next time, may your journeys, wherever they may take you, be safe, take care, and God bless. Bye for now.